we have some of the cars from Back to the Future Part 2. In that movie, they said we would have flying cars by the year 2015. I think we're running a little late. We have Fred Flintstones and Barney Rubble's cars from the live-action Flintstones movies. And various cars from various Fast and Furious films. We even have a gyrosphere from our mega-hit Jurassic World and Jurassic World Fallen Kingdom. Each one of these vehicles looks unique, but for every one of these vehicles, we have multiple versions, and each version has its own purpose. <laughs> I know. So I'm trying not to. Of course, that. I could be wrong about that. Baby dinosaurs can't be brought back from extinction. What do you think? Spinners. Why well, did it have to be spinners? At least that big one's not moving. Okay, so by now I'm sure you figured out things around here aren't always what they seem to be. That includes nature. Even the weather isn't always what it seems to be around here, and we own a Now we're going to take you to Old Mexico, where we have a couple of our special effects wizards who are going to give us a weather effects demonstration. Because you see, when we're filming, there are times we have to have very specific weather conditions, and we cannot always rely on Mother Nature to provide those. So sometimes we have to make our own. That's what we're going to demonstrate. Right here. So we're starting off with a little bit of thunder, a little bit of lightning, with it over there on the left. And now let's get some rain. Hi guys, can we get some rain please? And we have rain falling on the left. Now if you look at the rain, look a little higher, you'll see sprinklers shooting the water up into the air when it falls. It looks just like the real stuff, and it can be wet and slippery like the real stuff. So I think we should all stay seated just to be safe. But that's how we can create rain here in Hollywood. Thanks guys, that was great. Guys, can we get the rain please? Guys, are you listening to me up there? Hello? Uh-oh. Look at on the left. Remember what I said about getting wet, especially throughout the left-hand side. Oh, great. Don't worry about all that water. We are very water conscious here at NBC Universal. We're not going to waste any of it. It'll be back at the top of the game. Okay. Thank you. 
Christ site set is a perfect example of a set that is all designed around a vision that Stephen had. He said, again, to sit down to talk about the war of the world. But I thought, what if the 747 goes down right in a big neighborhood? Because it's, it's just something you don't see. You're doing good. By the way, this airplane is a very real airplane that was taken apart and brought here and made to look as if it had crashed on this set. Real airplane Hollywood crash. Robbie, get in. Get in. We are approximately 10 minutes from the end of the tour and we'll be returning to the theme park shortly. Now please remember, if you need any sort of assistance, pull that red cord, we'll get to you. Uh, let's go to the office now. Let's go, Cookie Puss! Uh, uh, it's a little man, it's cheap, something out there, and then it's all shot. Yeah, don't worry. Lucky for you, our whole family protects protection. Are you kidding me, Bobby? You can shut off your phone, bro? I gotta call you back. Just tell me you're Oh, yeah. It was all vibrating. A raccoon? Nice. Camera. And action. Dollar bill. Now the reason I've asked her to take out that dollar bill is Kiwi doesn't know her and may feel uncomfortable flying to someone she has never met. I've seen the Universal 7 Almighty. We have trained our birds to recognize and fly to a common object. In this case, it happens to be a dollar bill. I'm going to have you fold it in half for me. Fold it in half one more time. Perfect. Place between two fingers. Hold that arm straight out to the side, palm down. Perfect. Stay still. Kiwi's going to see that dollar and know exactly where to fly. <laughs> Perfect. Thank you. Enjoy the show. Potter movie. 